here you can see an example of um, where you might need this so here I'm using ES browser and there at the bottom it shows the SD cards name so um, in this example I'm going to use um, this video editing program as uh, an example of what problems the SD cards name might cause So you say I've added this uh, this video, and if you click on it there on the corner, it shows the address of where this video is stored. So notice that there in the path, it uh, has the SD card's name in it. So look what happens um, if we change the memory card, and if you even copy the same video to the same folder but in a new memory card so if we go to this um, editing program again and we open the video then it says the video is missing then if you click on the information it shows there that um, SD card BDB9 is not basically in the phone so this is one reason why you, want, we, you would want to change the SD card name. So here we're using a mini tool partition wizard. And this is how you change the SD card name. So you don't have to worry about the, the hyphen or capital letters only pay attention to the letters and the numbers so let's look at what happens again if we go back to the same video there you see it works now because we've changed the SD cards name if you're wondering why I don't just do it on the phone uh, it's because the phone won't allow you to edit the SD card name. So that was on ES browser and this is on root browser. And you can see with none of them it works.